Well, uh, this is something else, and how unbelievably bad it is. This is Safety Driving Simulator Moto! Check this out. So this is like the tutorial thing. It's, it's turn on the vehicle and start to, and start the vehicle. It doesn't tell you what key it is. Even, I rebound all the keys, but it doesn't tell you which it is at the start, so you gotta know. So I do that, and you, you're not in gear, so you shift into gear. And it says, alright. Drive through the obstacles without hitting them. Here I am hitting my churn keys. I'm really hitting them. I'm hitting the churn, and nothing happens. So that's amazing. So you go back to these, like, all right, what did I churn to? Turn left, A. Turn right, D. The most logical controls there really are if you're going to use a fucking keyboard to do a driving game. WASD, it's what you use for everything. So you say, all right. You hit default and check this out. Go back here. Jeez, do I, I don't even know how to fucking turn this thing on now. There we go. And you try to use the arrows because maybe you think it doesn't bind your keys right. No. It's not that either. <laughs> yeah. Those are the fall controls. I have no controller plugged in right now because you can't... Well, that's a different thing. Let me plug in the controller real quick. I hope I don't need to restart the game for it to recognize it. Let me plug in the controller. And we'll show off this part too. This is great. So the controller's plugged in. I don't know if it'll... Oh, shit. That's the mouse, by the way. That's... Like, every time I try to rebind something, it just takes an axis rotation from the fucking mouse. So it's like, I want to rebind this. Too bad, it's a mouse button now. It's a mouse thing. It's a mouse thing. My mouse is literally... I'm, my, I'm holding the mouse in the air, so it can't possibly pick up me, like going on something. I click it. You see that? It still says actual rotation. So we default these. I really don't know these controls to see. Alright, button 11. What the fuck is button 11? Who knows? So we'll figure this out as we go, because this is... The only way to control it is through the fucking controller, it seems like. So we'll go... On. Turn the... On. Up shift. Oh, I do need to restart it for the controller to be picked up. Damn it. Ah. Uh. Oh, well. Hmm, is there anything else I can do to maybe pick up the controller? Input miscellaneous? I don't see nothing. Annoying. Be right back. Boom! Wasn't that fast? So here we are again. We're gonna do this again with the controller. And this is funny. So you start. This is the Xbox 360 controller, the most common controller we use on PC games, I would assume, really. So we go and start the engine. And it idles right there because it's controlled by the left analog stick's position. When you let go and it just sits in the middle, you're doing that. Which is annoying. On, and your handling is also controlled by that, so... You know, that's great. You turn and accelerate with one joystick. And I don't know how to shift with this controller right now, so we're shifting... With... My other hand on the keyboard, and this is... I need to figure out how to shift. That's impossible. Okay, so that's on. That's GPS or something. That's signal. That's reset. These buttons don't even make any goddamn sense. Hitting pause rotates the camera. And I don't know how to rotate it back. I don't know how I even rotated that. So left bumper resets you. Right bumper does the blinker. The back button on the controller does the other blinker. A is to start the vehicle. No fucking button, however seems to want to shift on these default controls. That's great. Alright, whatever, let's go. I'm trying to drive in a, like, using, like, some stupid ass settings. This is extremely difficult. It's like trying to drive with your foot almost. Well, I guess, no, not driving with your foot, because you really do drive with your foot, and it's... Yeah, you do that. The hard part is you can't just kind of slow down really easily. This is good. You can coast if you just let it sit like this. That works. 
Don't ask me why I have a blinker on. I don't know. So I could just coast at like 50 if I just shift into the top gear. Accelerate a bit. No. Road's getting narrower. I'm supposed to slalom. But yeah, the controls on this are terrible. I'm using... Like, I have to use my left hand on the keyboard and my right hand is on an Xbox 360 controller using the left... controlling the left joystick. So, uh, yeah, you try controlling the left joystick on a controller with your right hand. It's not intuitive at all. You really have to think every movement over and you're not used to doing it and it's, it's very difficult. Trust me. And that's the first lesson. And then this one's about the brakes and some courses and then there's roundabouts. I don't, I'm just going to do this though, the start driving because this is uh, slightly more interesting. You could choose a bike from mopeds up to mopeds again. Oh, it looks like a bicycle. Is that even powered? I guess so. So a motorcycle. There we go. That's, a, yeah, that's probably the best one there is. Oh, what's this one? Hmm. They have the same stats. One has more power, but it's no faster than the other. How weird. Alright, okay, can we do that? Select devices. Approved cheap open face helmet. Not approved open face helmet. Not approved full face helmet. So you could learn about all this helmet stuff. Half helmet. Not approved by law. And I don't think any of this is relevant to me because I'm in the US and this is... I don't, I don't know what country this is designed for actually, I just don't know. Ordinary jacket. Can I do, no, no shirt, no gloves, no pants, boots, you're a boy. <laughs> do I want to fasten my helmet? Nah. What the heck am I doing? And you got missions. We'll do the mid-sized town. Driving route. Arrival. Eco drive. Pursuits. Sorry. We'll do just um driving route. Follow the route shown. That sounds easy enough. We'll do it at night. And actually, I don't have to turn my lights on for sure. So let's not do it at night. Physio, physical, so what? Oh look, you can simulate how drunk you are. Where's the junk as fuck, bro? <laughs> you had one joint. Let's go ride your bike. You had one, one halluc hallucin. Oh my god, I can't say it. It's funny. It's just like one. It doesn't say. It doesn't specify what it is. It's just one of them. One cocaine stripe. One. Oh my. God. This is great. <laughs> one. Oh yeah. <laughs> Sleep. Heavy meal. Oh man, full. Let's do uh, a. <laughs> I'm mean, gonna ride my bike with three cocaine stripes, three joints, and three X's. Hey, let's go. <laughs> this is so. Alright, I found something fun with this. It's just. It's gonna simulate all of those at once. Like, holy fuck, that's a lot to be doing at once. Alright, let's see. Upshift. Oh my god, I can't even slow down. This thing is too fucking fast! Holy shit! <laughs> I don't think these controls are... <laughs> Driver physical damage. What the f... <laughs> what is this? Let's go again! Like, okay, this bike is way too fast with these control schemes, though. I, I cannot do just a little acceleration. Like, oh, like I try to do a little acceleration, but you can't. I need to upshift all the way, probably. That might help a little. Yeah, that'll help a little bit. But, oh my god, it's still fast as shit. For, like, where I'm going. And, yeah, my controls are terrible. Like, I hit churn, and he doesn't churn, and he does churn, and oh, I'm dead. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, I'm in a wheelchair this time. Okay. I lost my motor ability. Alright, so if we upshift all the way, it's a little bit easier. But, oh my god, the controls are so delayed. This is so stupid. 
This is the stupidest thing I've ever done! And I missed the thing. I missed the thing. Oh, I hit a tree. The funny thing is, I'm trying to go as slow as I possibly can right now. Uh, obviously that's a bad idea, so let's, let's use a slow bike. I'm not even use a bike. Scooter! Select the gear, alright. So what if I say, I'm gonna use all the safety stuff. Full everything. Which is a motorcycle jacket, motorcycle gloves, motorcycle pants, and I even fastened my helmet. We'll do the same thing, we'll try that again. And uh, yeah, that was impossible to control. Let's just try one beer, let's see if that's controllable. And this thing's already off. Can't go that fast though, I mean, it's a goddamn moped with a 50cc engine. Oh man, one beer. What's with up these shadows? Dude, look at those shadows. They're flipping the fuck out. I don't know what the fuck's going on. Like, somebody's playing this guy? Oh, sh we gotta be shadows, me. Alright, you can control this one because it's slow. Indicators not used. I don't even know the goddamn controls for the indicators. Wait, uh, oh, wait. The back button and the left bumper. Got it. Bitch, I just used the indicator. Shut your mouth. No, wait, I turned it off when I turned it? I don't know which is on or which is off. I can't fucking tell. Oops, continuous line cross. It's really just like, these stock controls are really stupid. Speed! Go, little moped, go! Can I hit people? Oh, oh, just, yep, yeah, okay. I don't know if I hit the person or the vehicle. No damage, thanks to all of my safety stuff. Let's try that again. This time we'll use the, um, the signals because I didn't think about it the first time. I just want to kind of do it right. I use the indicator. What do you mean indicator's not used? Do I have to... How do they fucking work? Like, sometimes I click the button and they work. Oh, the person! Ooh. Did I kill him? Oh no, they have to make scrap iron out of it from a... 42 kilometers an hour crash? How the hell did that happen? I was going like 10! I wish I knew how the blinkers actually worked. It really seems like they don't work sometimes. I don't know why. Whatever. We'll just try our best. There's a hundred spots we have to go to, so... Alright, if you hold the analog stick down, your head tilts to the side for no real reason. That's... useful. And the other thing is the blinkers don't automatically turn off like they would in the car, so that's a little... I'm not used to actually manually turning off blinkers after I turn. Or are they turning off? I mean, why won't it turn off? It won't stop blinking! Ugh. And it wouldn't turn on that way. I hit to turn on for going to the right. So I turn off the blinkers by hitting go to the right. Okay, yeah, that makes so much sense. I can't turn off the left blinkers by hit, going hitting the, the left blinker, but I can turn it off by hitting the right blinker, yeah. Speed limit's 50 kilometers an hour. 51 is well within reason. Don't give me no bullshit. Oh goodness, okay. That is not what I meant to do. I've, I'm have i thinking the, the blinkers would be a mirror image of themselves, so like both bumpers would be blinkers. I forget, left bumper is reset. So yeah. I can't, my head is in the wrong direction. I don't know how to fix it. There we go. I tried to use the indicator and the other car just went. I assumed the light would be green. These indicator controls are garbage. Like I can't know if I'm in a if I hit the keys, sometimes I don't work. Like, I hit the button right there, nothing. Hit it there, nothing. Hit it there, nothing. Hit it I'm not even looking at the lights right now. I'm just hitting the indicator button and nothing's happening. There. That time it worked. That time it worked. 
this time it's not working. When I'm accelerating, the indicators don't work. What about when I'm churning? They don't seem to work while you're churning either. They only seem to work if you let the, like let go of every other control. Wow. Alright, I lost. Like I wasn't paying it. Like I'm more interested about what the hell's up with the the blinkers. So or right, now they work while accelerating though. They work just fine with acceleration here. Look, I'm hitting them on and off, no problem. Blinker is on, we're good to turn. Other blinker went on right, no problem. And they don't automatically turn off. I don't know why I thought they did for a bit. But they stay on, so... I just lost points, and indicator didn't work there. Like, I hit it twice. And that guy just, yeah. Great. Like, I don't, I don't think I actually can brake right from these controls, because everything seems really slow for the brakes. I guess not. Wow, alright, well, yeah, this is why I don't have a motorcycle license. That, and motorcycles aren't controlled this terribly, and when you hit the indicator, it works. I had to hit it twice right there. I don't know if you could, there's no way you could tell, but I had to hit it twice right there for it to fucking work. I noticed it wasn't working, so I hit it again. That one worked first try. Hitting indicator, had to hit it twice. Because my left one was on. Indicator's not used properly. What am I even churning for? Really? Going 52 and a 50? Really? Really? Like, really? You expect me to be able to precisely hold 50 without any sort of cruise control system or anything? With the world's worst control system? Yeah, sure I can do that, buddy. Lights green. Can't turn blinker off. Trying to turn it off. And it won't shut up. There it goes. I love that I'm going to get in trouble for going 52 and a 50. So I really... 52 and a 50. I don't have enough ability to slow it down enough. Like, if I try to slow it down, it's not... I... It's, it's really... Because now I can't turn, really. Because I'm having to hold the analog stick up so at such a specific angle to hold 50. I really can't churn well. And they really don't give you much time where that thing comes up to tell you it's a red light. Like those last 10 feet are so slow. And I collided with the vehicle? Of course I did. Of course I collided with the vehicle. How do I fix my face? There. Are we turning right? Indicator work. Is it fucking on? On oh, indicator. Oh, gotta go 50. Bumpy ass road. Like, I keep swerving like this because Trying to hold the analog stick so precisely is not easy. Like, I swear, because it's hard to be that precise. Look at how slow it is to get from 10 to 0. Like, it's, it's faster to get from 40 to 10 than 10 to 0, it almost seems like. Oh 
Oh my god, those, those shadows. Those shadows are... I don't even know if you need to use a blinker in, into a roundabout. I would assume so. Makes sense to me. It's one thing I've never had to think about. If I actually need to use a... Or I should say indicator, as they call it in this game, when you enter a roundabout. Exiting one, sure. Entering, it's like, where, where else are you going to go? Alright, we're going to win it this time, or at least finish it. Or something. On one beer. So maybe that's why the controls feel a little sloppy sometimes, too. Yeah, but I really love that going 52 and a 50 is bad. I have never heard of a cop giving out a ticket for going two kilometers over... Well, okay, this is in kilometers, I'm pretty sure, so it's not American. Yeah, because there's no way you'd be going 50 through a city area. That's ridiculous. So let's say that's about, I don't know, 25. And then you're going 26, basically. And the cops give you a ticket. So how the... You expect somebody to hold 25 that perfectly. Because I'm losing points for it, so it's the equivalent of giving, getting a ticket, if you ask me. Alright, indicator, indicating, indicate! It's not there. Had to hit it three times for it to turn on. Hit it, and it worked first time there, see? So random. Almost done. Exceeding the speed limit by two miles per hour. And driver's license suspended. For exceeding the speed limit by two kilometers an hour. Well, for driving in a drunk state. But I don't think where I'm at. Well... Like, your average beer, like a shitty ass, you know, low alcohol content, I don't think one is legally enough for you to, I don't know, I don't, I don't care about that because I don't drink, but I don't think one beer is enough to legally be considered in a drunk state. So my license was suspended for being drunk when I wasn't drunk. That makes so much sense. What other places were there? Let's just say fuck it and crash into everything. Full safety gear, because we're going to go crashing. Extra urban driving. Free roam, man. And we're going to do this where we're... Oh, man, we're so full. No, we're going to do this. High as fuck, man. We're going to be high as fuck when we drive in. Driving extra urban road, hills, and industrial zone. Note, scenery has long loading times. It actually says that right there. Note, scenery has long loading times. That's funny to me. I think it's funny. Uh, I just want to crash because it's fun to crash. Don't judge me. I'm just here to crash and that's what I'm going to do. Oh man, what's up with this tunnel visioniness? Whoop, that was a little faster than I meant to do. I wanted to get some real damage doing, but I accidentally screwed that up. Yeah, I'm not even touching the accelerator and I exceed 50. That's the best part, I'm not even touching the accelerator. Yeah! Yes! Holy shit! Oh, I survived that just fine. Alright, I can go straight through trees, no problem. Alright, alright, this is gonna be good. Oh, oh! That has to hurt something. Ha <laughs> ha! That's, uh. I don't know what. Uh. Ek, uh. Fallen means, but I'm pretty sure that's bad. All right, here we go. Three, two, one, launch. Can't control this shit. Oh, God. Oh, my God. Oh. <laughs> I 
like I did. I died. <laughs> I'm surprised that killed me and the other one didn't, though. I guess the way the game's engine is, I kind of lost velocity in the air. Because when I hit the jump, I was going 140, but when I think I actually hit whatever I was flying into. Whoops. Oh, that couldn't be so bad. My body mostly slid. Elbow and shoulder, and I hit uh, 158. I really shouldn't have done all those drugs before I did this one, though, because it's... Controls are not pretty! That's it? That was a pretty bad crash. Alright, let's uh, do it without... All the drugs and shit, let's just say, yeah, we have the safe shit just to see if we could break through it. Same place, that one had fun hills. And this one will just say, man, I'm full. That's it, just I'm full. I, I like being able to see around me, that's a nice feature. Oh uh, yeah, it actually does feel like a much, oh, more controllable thing. 200. 200 into the back of a truck. No di no injuries. That's something. How do I get to the hills, damn it? It is difficult to accelerate and churn at the same time, though. That is the... Because these controls, like I said, you're doing everything from one analog stick. That is, uh, not... Whoa, easy. Ooh, that looked bad. Death? Didn't look that bad. Alright, maybe we'll try to take it slow. Until we can find some hills. This is the speed I go at, not accelerating at all. And top gear. Uh oh. What's going on? The game was uh, laggy. Oh, I did the wrong thing. Oh well. Alright, I'm bored now. Uh, that's been Safety Driving Simulator Moto, in which I did nothing like you were supposed to. Oh well. Until next time, this might be our I'll see ya.